yeah, dito Pinoy ang vida. Jaime Mendejar still here with Coach Mark Dandan for this match at hand. Their three opponents so far also knows that same story. Ubalde inside to Kalisan for the first two of the ball game and the first two para sa San Juan Kings. Really taking advantage of the depth nitong uh, rotation nila. Inside, brilliantes blocked from behind but the foul whistled here against Ubalde. Carry throughout this game. Itong mga first punches ng San Juan. By Alarcon. Leads that three on two. Will lose that basketball to Panganiban. Looking ahead, Ubalde all alone. Four to two now. San Juan, abante ng dalawa. Panganiban another board. We'll bring it down for the blue shirts. Attacks the lane. Goes to the reverse. Lefty finish. Beautiful move. Would be my guess. Whistle for that foul. So take another look at that escape. Coming from Panganiban nga. Brilliantes almost loses that basketball. Able to recover. Gets it to Jay Gars. Gets that bump. And two free throws coming up. Para kay Jerome Garcia. A good sign. We all know that Jerome Garcia can light it up. Had a slow start in that ball game. I had a chance to cover that game previously as we see Mike Kez getting another layup here for the San Juan Kings while si Panga nagiging kaibigan nila dito. Leading by 4, 8 to 4. Garcia stepping back for 3. That's off or should I say that was an assist to Pido. He take the two points. Hard screen by Mike Kez. He leaps over Pido after. Garcia aggressive to begin this ball game. Garcia though, miss a Alarcon will run it once again. Hands it off to Brillantes. Black by Ubalde. Garcia will miss off the glass. Ahead to Panganiba now. Attacks to the right side this time. Gets another two. This illegal screen. So take another look at that penetration from Panganiban. Still 5 and 35 remaining sa ating first quarter. Alarcon trying to hound itong si Miranda. Able to get that steal. Looking to make that up for that block. But instead, foul whistled against him. Triple doubles in other leagues. Liwanag dun sa gitna ng tatlo. I hate to be the one to go through that elevator. No? <laughs> Ovalde gets another two, four points so far para kay Ovalde. His team ahead by four, 12 to eight. Missing on that long jumper was Brillantes. Looking ahead, touchdown to Michael Galisan. Heinz Minguez. Looking for Pido, but stolen by Panganiban. Need the three on three, attacks the lane once again. Sabi mo nga, you have to stop this guy in transition. Point guard and one team is missing four young guys. Let's get back to you, Hyman, Coach Mark. Thank you for the report, Daniel. And uh, so far, it has been San Juan. Creating some cushion to begin this ball game as Ubalde underneath. Gets a six point of the ball game. Played excellently against the Cam Norte Warriors. So, alam mo nga malalim din talaga despite the absence of Womar. It's Panganiban doing his damage now from outside. Hot sila, yeah. literally. Against San Juan. And uh, field goal shooting as well for them has been a bit of a struggle. But able to address that from that attack is J.R. Olegario plus the foul that San Juan was able to sink. Wang, unable to add to that three-pointer, but Malonzo there to clean it up. Talking about the free throw shooting, in one and very kick out. Malonzo just for to shoot off balance shots. That will miss. Wang with a second to shoot. Ball is alive. Wang put up that shot. And Obalde, his presence of mind, getting that two-pointer. Nice attack there this time from Mendoza. Six points so far to his name. Malonzo goes to Soberano in the corner. Three-pointer para sa San Juan. Talagang itong big man ng San Juan. They still have a second to put this up. Got Music. 1,000 din yun. <laughs> 1,000 din yan. <laughs> Starting off strong against the Beagle Spicy Oragons. Soberano step back. Can't get that three-pointer. Malonzo Lilipad. What a clean-up job para dito kay Malonzo. Problem if somebody's guarding is Malonzo. He's going to be smaller. Kasi napaalaki ng front line na itong San Juan. Spartosa, specialty of the house. Soberano once again. 
Goes to Galinato. Another three-pointer. Neto na sila, Coach Mark. That three-pointer now clicking. Still, unable to get that basket underneath. As Oligario, pass ahead to Menguez. 35 to 22. 7 and 22 left sa ating first half. Malonzo. Goes to Soberano for another three-pointer. That's three-pointer number four now para sa San Juan. To get those offensive rebounds. So yeah, take a look at the fast break points earlier. 12 to 1 in favor of San Juan. So not just the outside sniping, but also those transition points as Oligario answers on the other side. So Perano once again, another three-pointer. Another conversion. But the yung uh, bounce dito. Shooters bounce. Now ng San Juan. 41 to 25. Biggest lead so far here for the Kings. At 16, Wang. Yun ang hirap pag tumatama sa labas na. Yun nga, sin stretch out mo yung depensa. Now, you're susceptible to attacks or off the dribble. Marilao dials it, out, dials it from outside. 43 to 30. Galinato goes to Habilionar. Attacking strong, goes to the spin. And the finish. Okay, uh, come here. Weapons are blazing, confidence high, despite uh, being short-handed. Ooh, another sorry miss, but Brillantes able to get that put back. Anytime someone makes a run, you never see anybody put their head down na nakasimangot. You know, great move there by Zaki Wang. Mentality is going on to the next play. That's a great fake by Zaki Wang. Tapik, mapupunta kay Garcia. Looking ahead to Marilao against Soberano. Kido, mid-range. Well, uh, hindi ka naman nagpapahuli, Coach Mark, uh, should I say? No? As uh, Zaki Wang gets another two. Mainit siya dito sa ating second quarter. Ligario back in the ball game now for the Oragons. Goes to Pido. Kick out, Jerome Garcia for three. Gets that three-pointer to go and just might wake up. The offense of Jagars. Yeah, they, they're there. He's staying in front of them. And guys like Keith Pido really stepping out. He's cutting the lead again, down to 10. Playing very well with the spicy Uruguay. Fighting for that rebound and they lose it. Ikot nila, Garcia for another three. Gets another one! Jerome Garcia cuts it down to seven. Here in the last couple of minutes, Galinato attacking the lane, finishing with the left. Cetilio will attack. Will miss. Gets his own board, drops it off to Oligario of the glass. Gario, reading it well, cutting at the right time for that easy layup. Throws it up as time will run out. They want to. We'll see Dito's the second half. Eh. Begin the third. Pulling the chair from underneath. Causing that turnover as Oligario. Speeding up on the other end. Cedillo was open for three kanina. Same was Garcia. Inside Cedillo. Turn around is good. Four to shoot para sa San Juan. Floats it up. Gets the bounce para kay Marvin Taiwan. Another opportunity may baba ang kalamangan. He will try from outside. Tuloy ang apoy. Pumana pa. Si J.R. Oligario. J.R. Oligario shooting in the face. Marvin Taiwan. Kahit nakataas yung kamay. Taiwan. He will attack. Gets clipped by Oligario. Head to the line for two. Situations we're in. Tsaka yung alam. There's still the driver's seat. Na hype lang tayo of course because uh, the spicy Uragons really putting up a fight. And speaking of fight, Menguez. Gusto kalisaan. Garcia almost getting that block with just one shoe. <laughs> Been uh, quite a story, but he will instead be whistled for a foul. A great hustle nonetheless. As you said, I make a 56 to 54 pa rin tayo. Pido. Screen from Cedillo. Attacking the defense of Pavilionar. Turn around jumper is short. But will be fouled. One by four. Wide open for this long jumper off. Rebound, Maokua, and drops it off to Habilionar. He will be fouled, plus the basket. I see the replay here. Yun na, pinakagat ni Kalisan. And thumbs it down to Habilionar. Medyo swinerte na. 
Mababol pa niya yung bola doon. Pala ng plan niya na mababol muna. They go to Garcia. Ah, in the sky, play to Pido! Goes to Habilionar, just five to shoot. Maikez, thought about the three, inside to Habilionar, back to Kalisaan! Just in the nick of time. Another super fan ng atin sa atin ng Pilipinas Super League as we take a look at uh, the performance of the Bicol Spicy Oragons in this quarter. Front line. Okay. Iwan at... Ahead to Soberano. Inside to Havillonar. Won't get the roll. 63 to 59. 4-point advantage pa rin para sa San Juan. As Wang goes inside. Able to finish is Havillonar. Literally. Also helps that there's... Miranda goes to Huang. Soberano now will try from outside. Nato Klao! Soberano with a rare four-point play. Every time that uh, Bicol. Seven seconds now. Soberano stepping back. Gets another basket. Soberano when you needed it most. Lalo ako. Avilinar at the post. Shadowed by Cedillo. Short stab will work. First two points. <laughs> malamig na malamig pa ito. Si Joseph Ovalde will see if what kind of impact he can bring to San Juan. Ang galaw na ni Galinato. Actually, it will wear out itong spicy Uragon and that's what's happening right now. Galinato, back-to-back baskets. Five straight points para sa kanya. Talking about Beacon, but they're starting to wear out dito sa fourth quarter. The question nga uh, kung masusustain nitong uh, Beacon, but may guess. Keeping them close. Valde, siya na rin magbababa dito para sa San Juan. Goes to Soberano, wide open. That's automatic. That's a layup for AC Soberano. He's still there, but uh, time is not on their side. Swang, his attack, foiled. But Valde there, now in double digits with 11. Have been playing a lot of minutes. Keeping up with the San Juan squad, talagang uh, at all order in itself. Sa Oligario doon, hindi pa rin titigil dito. Now with 20. Struggle nga ni uh, Jerome Garcia, especially from the three-point arc. Those opportunities, but dito naman sa San Juan, uh, hand on the face. But Malonzo still able to get that bucket. All nine points in the first half. Marilao will get that three. Still a 16-point lead, 85-69 to 69 para sa San Juan. Kick out Malonzo. Pinawi din naman kagan. Talagang the offense of San Juan when it clicks. Just this quarter alone, dito lang talaga bumitaw. And uh, mahirap kung hindi mo kaya makipagsabayan. But Garcia finally able to get that uh, three-pointer to go. Partosa goes to Marilao. Two to shoot. He has to put this up. But time will run out. There seems to be uh, some extra motion after that shot clock violation was whistled. Mojica and Marilao trying to... May pabaon. May anghang pa rin na natitira. <laughs> and uh, Mojica is cut. cut. Looks like it's going to be disqualifying foul. <laughs> Mojica will uh, be patched up. Will shoot a couple of free throws. Kitang kita yung uh, galos. Ano? Minsan it's Mojica. Alarcon will run it. As Partosa with him. Pulls up for three. Second three pointer para kay Adrian Partosa. You can only do so much. You play with a lot of energy. Yeah, malaking bagay na. You're missing four guys off the bench. Ooh, what a move by Miranda. Nice drop pass to Ubalde. Last few seconds of this game. Likely just dribble it out. Gallant effort from the spicy Oragon sa San Juan at the end of the day. Uh, yung three-point shooting, uh, parang hindi rin pa sobrang init para sa San Juan. AC Seborano able to hit five of his own, finishing with 20 big points and three rebounds and very timely baskets.